so I can't hear myself speaking unless it's just me speaking. I can't hear it back, repeating it back to what I'm recording. In fact, is something it should be seen. You know what it means. If you were born pretty mature from the start, given the fact you had the honor that you know you hope so contently in the moment, doing whatever needs to be done every single moment. I've been vegan for 12 hours. I've worked out two hours in the last 48. The week before Sunday, I worked out half an hour every day, except that first Sunday, so six in a row. That's all I'm trying to say. For some reason, after working so hard up in Guelph for my brother, volunteering, doing what I can, not being the best proven, not being snoozing, just doing it for the grub, man. I just want to hug. I just want to see him again. You never know if that'll be the end. Who knows? We can't tell. Two-year-old. Don't want to say it, but... You know. You never know. God bless all. Mightily. And well. Thank you, Logan for giving me this moment to express myself as I'm so choosing to do. Cruising to no beat, just loose. Giving you the need to proceed. Yeah, you heard it before. I don't repeat. Unless it got steeped. It's stuck in my membrane. I can't help but to need that power, that flow, them words been said before up in my mind. I can bring it back. 98% of what I retain. I can lift back. It's just a matter of fact. I don't give a shit about saying. So why have the power? I know why. You louder. Hear that? Piss, pull, plaws. Ain't no one enveloped. We are the envelopment of mankind's resurrection to save the earth once and for all. This stuff make it so I can't sleep. It make me want to go vegan. It make me want to work out. It make me want to work at work really hard. It make me want to do my chores. Now I know my room looks messy. But in fact, that's how I want it, yo. You don't understand. The more I look at things out in the open, it holds a presence of knowing you got it all. From every single need, from walls, some murals. I'm cured, yo. Thank you for the offer. I can't say that. I take it no doubt, bro. Who am I to live last? Decaying throughout the world. If I had one wish, I'd wish to be able to give without leaving the opportunity to give again. Thank you, God. Amen. That's the greatest gift of all.
either my prayer gets answered at the right time or possibly there is something better y'all but I don't know I just want to give to give it all we can start with this take a break take a five minute stress break because when you're on clock you're expected to pace walk do this and that for a whole eight hours of the day whereas I Focus on one hour of health, going hard for something that builds me. Meanwhile, people making machines, putting fumes in the air, doing things that we really don't need. It's fair to say we've come far enough, and just for sake of modernness, we are at the point of virtual reality. I can't, I can't get over this. Kids are enthused by virtual reality. Why? It's reality, but you have to pay for it. And you have to hook it up to your face and have it glowing in your eyes. You move your hands a little bit. You get scared. Oh, my. I guarantee once you pass that level, oh, maybe I'll try something different. So when is it going to end? We picture ourselves as being everything. That's what we need. We need everything. We won't stop until we get it because it's what we need. Until I have everything, I won't stop. I don't get it. We could pause and realize that farming is needed more. We have to grow. And I know it's a chore, but we need food first. We're building Lamborghinis, Ferraris, making chains of gold. It just makes me feel sorry. For saying I'm different. When deep down inside, we all want and need the same thing. And that's a rise. We have to rise above the fact that people have made mistakes and people are going to make them again. But if we have an environment that is more friendly to equality over having the biggest paycheck because that's all it is anyone try to tell me that they're living for any other reason than a paycheck is beyond me as someone once said money makes the world go round 
Not entirely. You see, money is just a form of saying you owe something. Or you own something. Either way, it's not a quality. Nothing on earth is owned by anyone unless it's fair, fairly owned by everyone, being a quality. Imagine this. If everyone got what they needed first before continuing, To progress towards what are we trying to be? We have a perfectly good home here as long as we can kind of go back and see some of the mistakes we made. Plastic hurts. It takes too long. To break down. It was a mistake. But if we don't fix it, it will escalate. Please, see me out. It doesn't have to be harder than it needs to be. If people focus on food, everyone will agree. Because before you know it, it's time to eat. And after you eat, why compete? Why not just say, everyone is equal and everyone deserves nice things and everyone gets to share what is here for free money does not decide what someone gets I tell you if God wants you to have it It will be. Now is that to say God doesn't want people to have money? Possibly. There is a life to be lived properly without the need for money. Think about it. The more money we make, It just never ends. Eventually, I don't know how to put it, but what I'm trying to get at, my main focus is that money makes people do things that they wouldn't normally do. Who wants to work eight hours a day for minimum wage just to go home and pay it all back to food? How about this? If it's been built, thank you very much. If it's been grown, thank you very much. If you are doing something for the sake 
of bettering humankind and not personal gain, then we can coexist. Until then, we are all separated by money. I won't know him or her or any of them because money exists. It's keeping me from more natural things. The fact that I work so hard for money when I could put that same effort along with everybody contributing, making it less hard of a work effect on yourself and everybody to just focus on the needs, like global warming. It's harsh. They don't want to blow it in your face because they're sorry. And we forgive them. We just have to realize, man, life goes on. I will not... Life goes on. I will not let it cease. Because currently, it's ceasing. I just don't want this to be the end. And it won't. As long as we can achieve unity. Give it up for the bond. To the earth. To the reason you get to feel a gravitational pull. As if to say, I will put weight on your shoulders. For you are sturdy. But to grow the future, you must get down and dirty. I'm sorry for just rambling off about nothing at all. That's what it's going to be. No one's going to hear it at all. Who cares, y'all? Global warming. Doesn't that need, like, a second? Doesn't that require, like, global attention? Global warming? If the globe is warming, then the globe should be conserved. All I'm trying to say, it's enough, man. I just... People don't even know what they want anymore. I mean, seriously? Virtual reality? Go live your life. Virtual reality.
virtual reality. Does that sound right? Like, is reality supposed to be virtual? I don't like the sound of that. It's kind of scary to me. That can lead to some serious things. If that gets going, and we're starting to live lives virtually, and then we have to live the real life, it's like... Yo, let's not get too caught up in this, man. Because that will take your focus. If you glue a screen to your face and you play this, I don't understand it. Like, we have life. Let them live. The earth is calling. Once someone hears something like global warming, they should think, I am part of the global concern. To global warming. I don't mean to throw any ideas in the air, but what if the globe had food? Because that's another concern. I just don't understand why people go on and on and on and don't stop and think for a second. This life doesn't have to be this hard, honestly. Just give it to God in all my faith and belief and prayer and everything I can give from my heart, soul, body, and mind and everything that I'm about. Please. I want, I need equality. It's not supposed to be a competition. only thing that deserves recognition is the bond with earth in its current state being presently always focusing on earth first because that's where I live. And that's where you live and that's where everyone lives. This is our earth. And if you want to tell your kids go to work. I don't.
personally? I mean, I work. I like work. I like life because I do a lot. I do everything I can. I eat right. I work out. I express myself creatively. I'm socially active. I write. I sing. Man, I do everything. But it's not enough in the end. We're just chasing this fathom as if we were born to be better than one. It's too hard for me to get it off my chest because I'm at the point where I don't want to insult people at the top, but I'm trying to get everyone involved, but some people don't want to cooperate. It's usually the people at the top, but there's not many of them. It's more about us as a whole. The majority needs to speak. I don't know, man. It's cold. Either way you look at it, someone messed up somewhere and it can be held for this reason or that and no one's perfect, but come on, man. We're going to hold that against the homeless, man? You don't know what you got, man. You got it all. just hard to understand it takes time I don't know if it'll ever end the end good morning afternoon evening and night God bless you throughout amen